Welcome to my SU News Channel. Taylor Swift had Kanye West booted from Super Bowl seat in front of her suite, Brandon Marshall bizarrely claims. Former NFL wide receiver Brandon Marshall came out of left field with a bizarre story about Taylor Swift and Kanye West from Super Bowl 2024. Marshall, who played in the league from 2006 to 2018, claimed Tuesday on his Paper Root podcast that Swift had West kicked out of his seat at Super Bowl 2024 after the rapper purchased seats right in front of her private suite at Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas. More tea, so Kanye West pulls up to Super Bowl, Marshall said. Kanye West buys a ticket right in front of Taylor Swift's booth, so any time they were going to be showing, Taylor Swift, Kanye's face was going to be there. He had a mask on, typical Kanye. So, Taylor Swift gets pissed off. She, boom boom, makes a call or two, everybody's involved. Kanye, gets kicked out of the stadium. Hot tea, hot tea. He was trying to leverage her celebrity to make some, so you gotta go back to their beef. Marshall said it was Katy Perry's suite at first and clarified that he meant Swift. An NFL spokesman declined comment. Reps for both Swift and West have yet to respond to requests for comment. West was seen at Super Bowl 2024 which resulted in Swift's boyfriend, tight end Travis Kelsey and the Chiefs topping the 49ers in overtime wearing an Alexander McQueen Jesus mask over his eyes. Other videos on social media show the rapper and his wife Bianca Sensori walking up the stairs at Allegiant Stadium. Swift and West's feud stretches back to 2009, when the The Rapper ambushed the singer's acceptance speech for Video of the Year at the 2009 MTV VMAs and took the mic to declare that Beyoncé's video for Single Ladies was one of the greatest videos of all time. West later apologized the moment. The feud picked back up in 2016, when the infamous phone call, during which West discussed his song Famous with Swift, surfaced publicly. Kim Kardashian, West's wife at the time, posted video footage of the call on social media that made it seem as though Swift had approved of the lyrics, I feel like me and Taylor might still have sex slash why? I made that bitch famous. Swift denied that she had consented to it, but she was called a liar and a snake in a situation she later told Time magazine she felt was a career death at the time. In 2020, an extended version of what was said to be the same phone call leaked and appeared to indicate that the video Kardashian posted was edited. Kardashian addressed the situation in a series of posts on Twitter, now X, at the time, in which she denied editing the conversation and accused Swift of lying and said she never edited the footage. Swift recalled the situation in an interview with Time magazine in December 2023 the same interview which she spoke publicly about Kelsey for the first time. You have a fully manufactured frame job, in an illegally recorded phone call, which Kim Kardashian edited and then put out to say to everyone that I was a liar, Swift said in the interview. That took me down psychologically to a place I'd never been before. I moved to a foreign country. I didn't leave a rental house for a year. I was afraid to get on phone calls. I pushed away most people in my life because I didn't trust anyone anymore. I went down really, really hard. Kardashian has yet to publicly address Swift's comments. Source, nypost.com. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.